Hello viewers and welcome to another edition of ARK News. I'm your host Archivist and today I will be going through three topics related to either the gaming or tech world at the moment. Today the Xbox One is finally being released to retail and considering all the adverts uh, you probably already knew that. Some of the improvements over its predecessor the 360 include better graphics, better connect integration and enhancements to online functionality. However, there have been early reports from Europe of consoles breaking down upon arrival. One customer has shown his Xbox One failing to turn on at all. Although of course you do have to take into account that similar reports came out regarding broken Playstations and they turned out to be around less than 1% of total units. So I would imagine that the majority of Xbox Ones are absolutely fine, so don't worry. Another day, another review roundup. This time for Rise Son of Rome and Falls of Five. Falls of Five has achieved an average score of 82 on Metacritic, with critics praising it for its general polish and beautiful visuals. I have to say this is very impressive for a launch title. Rise Son of Rome on the other hand achieved a less impressive 61 average score. While critics were impressed by the graphics, many said that the combat became very repetitive. Please keep in mind that these average scores will change as more reviews come in over time. Apple has allegedly started testing a prototype for its new iPhone 6 with a larger 4.9 inch screen. Apple is said to be preparing two new iPhones next year and both should come with larger displays. Although this information is of course based on rumour, a larger screen would seem like a necessary step for Apple. While the iPhone 5S is an incredibly powerful device, seeing what it can do on a small 4 inch screen is a little underwhelming. On the other hand, I don't really want a massive iPhone with something like a 5.5 inch display, it needs to be bigger but not cumbersome. Hopefully with a larger screen we will even get a HD display. We all want 1080p for sure, however, I wouldn't put it past Apple to go even higher. This was another episode of ARK News, I hope you enjoyed it. As always people, thanks very much for watching and see you next time.